welcome or welcome back on any help at C squared. In this example, we have a triangle, triangle ABC, and we need to find what is called the perimeter of this triangle. The perimeter of this triangle or any other shape is the distance around the edge. So we use the letter P, and that means the perimeter of this shape will be AB, the length of AB, plus BC plus AC, the length of these three segments. And uh, the easiest one is segment BC because we just can count one, two, three, four. This is four units. For the other two segments, AB and AC, we really need to do a little bit of work. We can use the distance formula which I'm going to put it right here. Be sure you identify the X and Y coordinates of your points and move from there. Or you can use Pythagorean theorem like I'm going to do here. So, for example, if I want to find AC, this is the triangle I'm going to use. And I'm going to count again. One, two, three, four. 4, 5, 6, this is 6, and this is just 1, so I have a right triangle where the legs are 6 and 1, I need to find the hypotenuse, I'm going to use Pythagorean theorem, like I said, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, so in this case we have 6 squared plus 1 squared equals c squared, or c squared equals 36 plus 1, which is going to be nothing else than 37. c squared is 37, so c will be square root of 37. Remember, in this case, c is nothing else than the length of segment ac, square root of 37. A similar approach we're going to do for finding the length of segment ab. I'm going to use this triangle. And again, I'm going to count. One, two, three, four, five. This is five. And let's see the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is six, obviously, like the other side uh, for the other triangle. So we have a right triangle that has the two legs. 1 is 6, 1 is 5, and we need to find this hypotenuse. I'm going to still call it C, but it's a different C than the previous one. The same formula, A squared plus B squared equals C squared. The only difference, A is 6 or 5, it doesn't matter. 6 squared plus 5 squared equals C squared. So C squared will be 36 plus 25 or c squared equals uh, 61 and c will be square root of 61 and I, as i said c in this case is the length of segment ab which is going to be square root of 61 so now we can put the perimeter together here the perimeter will be the length of ab square root of 61 which cannot be sim simplified by the way the length of ac which is square root root of 37 and the length of BC which we start with that is 4. This is the exact value of the perimeter in case you need a, an approximation you have to grab a calculator and put in the calculator and approximate based on how you are asking the problem. If you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.